What's up, y'all? Welcome back. So this is an early access game called Mage Noir Infinity. My brother was kind enough to pass over an extra key for it. Let's check it out. It's supposed to be kind of like Magic the Gathering. You are a mage, as is your opponent. The little concept is, see, like in Magic the Gathering, you create, you summon monsters and artifacts, and then they go out and beat up the other guy for you. In this game, you're supposed to be able to summon stuff for yourself, and then you go beat the other person. You need to use your spells, play a flame by it, dropping it on the board. One damage to any target after the spell is used as a component, discard it. You prepare to flame. Activate it to play its effects. Activate. Target your opponent's HP directly. Okay. Play as many spells as you want during your turn. You reduce your opponent's HP to zero to win. It makes sure some of your spells need components to be prepared. So this requires breath times one. And then it'll inflict two damage to any target. And I get to draw a card. Okay. So each thing builds on each other. Zephyr needs a breath. A spell can count as a component for each word in its name. So because both of these have breath, they both work. Channel it to count as a component for Zephyr. I can now play Zephyr. Note the components stay in play even when you prepare or activate spells that use them. Now we learn about mana. Each player takes turns. This time your opponent will start. Turn starts by drawing a card from your deck. Use magical energy used to cast spells is called mana. What you see is the available ether. This is the source from which you draw your mana. There are six different elements. Add three of the water element. When mana is added to the available ether, it alternates between the two pools, starting with the smaller one. Okay, so both players, essentially, they're tapping to add mana to the mana pool. And then you pick which pool you want, because it goes back and forth about which type of mana you're adding. Okay, so essentially, you'll need to decide, do I add more of my mana, or do I add something just to mess with my opponent? And then do I take the mana that my opponent needs, or do I take the mana that I need? So in this case, there's three in this one, so we want this one. When spell is activated, it's locked mana and goes back to the available ether. So when you cast a spell, it goes back. Whammo! During the game, you can become a powerful mage noir. To achieve this, you'll need to form a ritual or rite. more powerful if you're a mage. Those spells are even only playable if you're a mage. So I am now a mage noir. I want to channel it so that I can do this guy. We'll activate. Okay. Choose your starting deck. Choose between four elements with varying play styles. You'll be able to improve these decks with the cards you unlock. Okay, so each power. Okay, so do I want wind, fire, water, or plant? It looks like they build off of each other. Like flame becomes fire, wind, tornado, 
druid to a piece of robe. <laughs> I am leaning towards the wind one. Ooh, now we're talking Cusco. Hiya, you now know how to play. Use your acquired knowledge to triumph over your opponent. Okay, so we need a bunch of air. Oh, we need some poison and green too. Can only be prepared by Mage Noir. Okay, so you're worthless unless until I activate you. Okay, so step one, get the breath down. Okay, so I want a bunch of air. And poison. But we'll get to that. Channel. So that's it, I'm done. Devastating target after the spell is used as a component, you lose one health. Okay, so I want to do arcane air, air, and I want the one with two air. I've got my three air, so I need arcane. Yeah, let's try that. Mm, see, he took my arcane. This spell costs one less arcane mana to prepare. Draw two cards. Oh. Okay, so I do this. See, so now do I hurt him? No, I need this one. What is my maximum hand size? So I need an arcane, two arcane, breath component you control. So I want you to get a whole bunch of breath out before I do you. So let's end it. What you can do? Flame.
Okay, so a lot of these win cards seem... Oop, hey, my face is right in the way, isn't it? Okay, so a lot of these win cards seem to... Put them back in the deck. So what do I need? I need... So I just need three wind and one green. There's the three wind, but so if I channel it, I don't get its powers, but I set it up as a third breath. Let's do it. So I got another tornado to get my howler's robe. I need two wind and a green. So there's the wind. There's the water. And there's my green. Okay, so now air spells cost one less to prep. They'll do more damage. Life is going to be good. Haha, <laughs> I gave you water. Okay, so I don't really care about that car. Oh, snap, it's at zero? Why is it a zero? Okay, so essentially I just want a whole bunch of wind right now. Wait. Have another water. Ha 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 ha. Why are you zero? Which components? What do you mean, which components? What? Right there. What am I doing wrong?
Can't I play anything? Fine, discard everything. Just auto release it, yeah. Fine. That's probably why it's still an early access. Okay. Why is all what? Why can't I collect any of my components? Okay, there you go. can't get any of my cards back but you can move past that open booster pack so I got nine moon knights So these are the packs that you start with, or the decks that you start with. So you get the entire deck. Eventually they've opened it up so you can do additional sets. more moon nights oh five additional moon nights because I already have it unlocked oh okay is this so now I have two of these is there any way to cancel or back out if we need to no so once you've committed, you're committed. Here we go. Ooh, so you get two options. I'm thinking these are
took the water? Who are you, Poke Epic? the game it'd be nice to try out a couple of the different decks but uh, starting with one having to buy booster packs although I do appreciate that you get the moon knights like I said this game is early access so they probably haven't implemented a whole lot of stuff yet they're still coming out with it um, they did this with a Kickstarter so you can get the actual decks and when you submit to the Kickstarter you were supposed to be able to just get every card. Originally, they were going to do boosters, but everybody was like, no, 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 no. We want all the cards. <laughs> so they shut down the Kickstarter and opened it back up with the new get promise of all the cards. So props to them for that. Um, did everybody pick wind? You know, if everybody's supposed to be picking a different deck and yet we had three win decks so far back to back oh I win one hundred and seventy five influence why was it less I do really like that they give the option of two starting hands I feel like I have to go with this one just because it starts with actual breaths <gasps> Fire! Yes, now we're talking. Mental flame. Well, channeled as a component. Start of your turn, pay one fire mana or discard this spell. Ooh. Whirling wind. So, hello, channel, and activate you. Ritual. <gasps> Mage Noir! Yes! Okay, so I need everything. What? This one. Fine. I need a wind and two 
arcane, so that's not gonna work. Over here, I need two wind, so wind, wind, wind. Good. So I can beat him on my turn. We shall fan out the flames. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? Oh, that wasn't so bad. down to 100 now. So it limits how many times that it wants you to play. I think that's enough. Uh, that wraps up this. Thank you so much for watching, y'all. It's, it's an early access. It clearly needs just a little bit of work still. Um, they are still introducing features, hopefully. 320 secret? No, those are Moon Knight tokens. Well, thanks for watching, y'all. Might be worth checking out. Um, if you get it cheaper now versus after they've introduced a bunch of stuff, it could be a lot more fun. Hope you all have a great week. Thanks for playing, checking it out with me. Peace out.